Welcome back to an episode of Famous Reality TV. And today, I'm coming to you all. We have some baddies ATL reunion drama going on. Of course, everybody is on their way to the reunion. Word on the street that Sarah Oliver will not be there. I'm not sure why she has decided not to come. I know she did have that altercation with Seven. Did they make up? I think they did to a degree. On the upcoming episode coming on Sunday, we're going to see her and Natalie getting into it. And they also had had some Instagram drama going on over the past week or two. Um, besides that, I look at that as the only reason that maybe she will not be coming to the reunion. And maybe she's just saying that and will pop up. Um, Sydney Starr and Judy. Judy is saying that, you know, she felt some type of way about Natalie putting her in that room. Natalie and Judy were recently messaging each other and Judy ended up posting their text messages which stated that the reunion was very, very expensive. Judy responded, Natalie, that is not disrespecting Zeus. Natalie, that caption calling Zeus showed the saddies. Okay, whatever you say, Judy, I honestly don't care. Judy, what you think I was on the show? Happy. Natalie, doesn't matter to me. Do you, girl? Judy had me room with a weirdo on a couch. Sarah ain't even coming. Be thankful I am. Relax. The fact that she was allowed to be on this show, I think that she should try to show some type of respect. Yeah, I probably wouldn't want her to room with nobody either. The fact that they had drama going on is the reason why, of course, Judy did not want to be in the room with Sydney. Had they probably been still cool, as I heard they were in the past, she probably wouldn't have had a problem with the bed. So, I don't know what the issue was with the house being so big that the girls weren't able to stay in their own rooms. But as you can see on Jocelyn's Cabaret, girls were rooming together as well. So, I don't know what the issue was with that. But you do also, besides the cast members, you do have a crew. So, they also have to operate some of those rooms. So, that's probably why there was not an extra room for Judy. Secondly, um, Sydney did get wind of it and she stated that she's going to see if Judy is going to be talking all of that mess at the reunion. And Natalie was like, you know, I'm not dealing with no kid shit or unstable kid posting business. Conversations headed to the hotel to check in and lay by the pool today. Natalie um, allegedly blocks Judy number on Instagram. She says, girl, stop playing with me. I mess around and I come for real. No disrespect to Zeus, but I'll disrespect to you because you're disrespectful. Some EP you are. So, in reality, um, there's going to be a bunch of drama, of course, on Baddies ATL. If the cast members even show up to the reunion, that's up for speculation at this point. I personally, um, I'm looking forward to the other half of the season. Of course, there was the mid-season trailer that they came out with on the Zeus Network a couple of days ago. And the half season is going to begin on Sunday. Looks like they're going to start turning things up a bit. Looks like some more drama and stuff. So, um... As far as the fans go, I do not understand a lot of these fans. They say, oh, they are and they have too much drama. Then when there's no drama, oh, it's too boring. Just be quiet and watch the show. Or don't at this point. But I am looking forward to season two of Baddies ATL because if anybody really know Natalie and follow her, you will know that this girl really be turning up. Like, she be lit, lit. Like, she be traveling everywhere and partying, popping bottles. Her, Janelle... Um, to name a couple just off of this show. Um, they really with that party style life. So that's what I'm looking forward to seeing. Like some boss stuff, some yachts, some uh air some private jets. I wanna see all that type of stuff on season two. So I do think we need to have some replacements on this show. <laughs> Not that this BGC, but you know, some of these girls need to be replaced. But um secondly I feel like what was going on with Christina and I believe it was Rocky and I can never remember the other one name, but the friend of Rocky, but they had been going off and stuff like that. I personally wish they just cut it out. You turned down the $5,000 or whatever they was offering you. You didn't want to be on the show. Why are you still talking about it? Like, what are you upset about? You mad with yourself that you didn't come on the show? So now y'all just trashing it 
and whatever and stuff like that. People can say what they want to say about Natalie Nunn, but you have to give your hat off to this girl. Like, a lot of these bad girls have not been doing anything with their lives since BGC. Natalie has been on several shows. She has Journey's Hair Products, um, which is her daughter's name. She has um, Natalie Lashes. She also has Fit by Pains, which is um, workout instructional manuals, little posters. Um, she has waist trainers and stuff like that, which she does that business with her husband. On top of that, she was on Celebrity Big Brother UK. Um, I think she was on Hair, what do they call it? Hair Spectacular. That was also on the OWN Network. Of course, she was on two seasons of BGC, as well as the all-star battle so the mother and daughter experiment as well as marriage boot camp so this girl has been working and putting in work so natalie nunn does have an extensive reality tv career when you compare it to these other girls now i'm not saying they don't have businesses outside of television but as far as getting a bag she does it so it's not count when she says she getting money the hate is real in my opinion but as i stated that was about it i just wanted to come and update you all on what was going on these girls tripping and hopefully it looks like judy is on the way i seen her on the plane actually with her dog so she is on the way to the reunion sarah i don't know what's going on with her we know sydney gonna be there tanisha so pretty much it looks like we just may be missing sarah so hey a lot of people probably glad she's not going to be there because she talked too much. But anyway, that's a whole other subject. Thank y'all for watching Famous Reality TV. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe.